Hi there guys, Kawa here. So, uh, we're gonna talk about this week's, uh, weekly events. Uh, I'm just gonna be real quick because there's not really much to really see. Uh, we got a new breakthrough and a skill trial. Uh, breakthrough-wise, we have Kabuto. Vanilla Kabuto. Uh, it's really bad, I don't remember anything special about him. Outside of, uh, he could chase, like, twice. That's the only thing I remember that, that's, like, remotely special. Uh, it's really bad that they're releasing them one at a time, because then we still have to go through all the other Konoha Genin, and there's just so many of them. I really wish that they would just uh, put it all out, out at once, like, at least do two or three of them at once, because these are really bad. Like, we still have, let's see, Shikamaru, we still have Choji, Ino, uh, I don't remember if Kiba has any, uh, I'm pretty sure Shino has, uh, who else am I forgetting? Uh, we already have Lee's, we have Neji's, Hinata doesn't get one, who am I forgetting? I feel like I'm forgetting someone. <laughs> Uh, but, uh, yeah, most, we're seeing a lot of the Ganyin people, and then, like, some of the, uh, other Konoha members, like the early on units. It's really bad that they're releasing it so slow, because these units are just, like, so bad for, like, servers who've been around. And, uh, newer servers don't really want to use them either. Uh, like, we still haven't gotten our Hokage Minato or uh, Hokage Hiruzen's uh, book. I only have one book that makes their uh, resistance buff permanent. But, uh, whatever. Uh, so for the new skill chart, we have Ginkaku. I got really excited at first, thinking it was um, Kinkaku, but it's Ginkaku. It's a silver one, not gold. Silver is a terrible one, uh, the one with the gourd. He I don't even really remember what he does. I just remember that uh, one of his things is like he becomes immune to all debuffs, and I, I think his Gord actually does like knockdown now. That's all I can remember. He's not good. But on the other hand, if it was Kinkaku, it would be great because Kinkaku, uh, he has the ability to remove immunity from people with his chase, uh, the rope. And then his uh, fan also has a uh, zero battlefield cooldown, so it's kind of like 10-10, but only for 40 chakra. So he's a lot better, and then his standard does, I think, high float or something like that. It's like, oh, it's so much better they just gave us uh, his brother instead of Kinkaku. It's like, oh, just give us Kinkaku. But this is another one of those things where I feel like they should release, like, more than one. But hey, uh, it, it, it's... We at least have three now. We at least have three skill trials. So it's better than nothing. I really can't complain too much about it. But it's still one of those, come on, you could be releasing them faster. Holding back on this is not helping them. And it's not doing anything. But anyways, uh, let's talk about this events. So it's the usual suspects here uh, in the Weekly Strong Ninjas. We have the Kakashi Susano. We have Itachi Susano. Uh, don't know why it's Susano and not uh, Edo. But... I can see already why, because, you know, Shinobi Feast is down here, but, eh, does anyone still go for Suzano Itachi when we have, um, Edo Itachi? Because Edo Itachi is definitely a hundred times better, but anyways, uh, we also have Raining on Sasuke, and we have Edo Hiruzen. I feel like they're really pushing this Edo Hiruzen. Um, I guess on the lower servers, uh, people could still use them, but, like, at the higher end places, uh, Edo Hiruzen's not that great. It's like, yeah, it's good for picking on people weaker than you, but in a real fight, he doesn't do crap. <laughs> like, you know, if I'm coming like well prepared for you, you're not doing crap with him. Uh, okay, uh, so Shinobi Feast, nothing special here. The usual recharge reel um, comes with Hashirama frags, uh, the Edo Tensei one. Uh, this gen, as usual, is pretty decent. Good time to recharge if you feel like recharging. Uh, it, it usually gives you some coupon return, but I personally pre uh, prefer the anniversary envelope because you know you always guarantee the set amount versus the Shinobi Feast one. So uh, we also have the, fe the Lucky Feast, you know, where we buy stuff with ingots. This is alright. Uh, last time they had some decent prices on the Miyaboku. 
items, and you know you had a chance to win that raffle for the ultimate essence. It was pretty good. I partook in it. Um, I probably would do it again if the prices are still the same and there's an ultimate essence again. Then I would try to win the ultimate essence again in the raffle. And as usual, we have the arena training. I'm just gonna assume Kabuto's books are in here. Um, they put it like books in here the last few times, so I don't see why they won't do it again. Uh, okay, down, we're down. Uh, Eno's flower, uh, it's a recharge of it, I think? Yes, 50 gets you one flower. Um, this event is not good. I don't suggest anyone to go crazy over it. The first prize is Edo Tensei Tobirama. It's like, really? You, you couldn't put something better in there? <laughs> it's so bad. This, this event is just oh, so bad. I, it would be better that you were just like, oh, here, we'll put like four, or actually not even four, four might be too much. Uh, like three um, skill books packs for, you know, Sasuke or, you know, um, A. Like, come on, something. Tokurama's Edo Tensei 80 frags? Ugh, not good. But on the bright side, it's not a cross server event, but you still have to meet the requirements to be on the leaderboard first. And it's just ugh, terrible. We also have a total spending rebate. Uh, I'm suspecting that either Hiruzen or uh, Kakashi's in here. I feel like one of them two are in here. And uh, we also have the Lucky Star Wheel. I feel like we're out of sync right now because it's been, what, two weeks since the last Lucky Star Wheel? Uh, I have no idea who's going to be in here this time because last time it was raining tomorrow, Frags. I don't know what's going to rain this time. Um, but yeah, it feels like it's out of sync, but maybe they're trying to, um, you know, uh, fix like the previous weeks because they, I mean, they probably weren't getting too much recharging. So they're trying to tempt us to recharge, uh, but, and you know, the Lucky Star Wheel is the event that um, recently has been getting a lot of attention because it does give out a lot of stuff. Granted though, I have no idea who could be in here this time. Zero clue. Uh, we'll find out tomorrow, though, uh, and we'll know if they're going to start raining frags again. I'll be amazed if we... Actually, I can't be Itachi Susano, but I'm say, if you put Susano Itachi in here and it starts raining those frags, oh, it's over. <laughs> uh, Alright, so Lucky Board, a uh, great event again, uh, as usual, for free-to-play players. And even if you're not free-to-play and you're still... Uh, but you're a spender and you have... Um, still items that you can get from the lucky board uh it's still a good place to go seek power especially when you know we do still have a spending rebate and a recharge rebate well technically two recharge rebates but i don't really count that you know flower thing so uh you, we you still have some uh, recharge rebates and we just had one this week with the naruto in it so it's still a really good place to spend some of your ingots if you can still find power items in here uh, Fishing Mania. This event is always a hit or a miss. Uh, usually I just grab the Unbound Runes because they're like cheap and then you get a good amount of them. I think you, got, I think you get about like 40 of them or something like that. Uh, it's, you know, it fluctuates because it depends, it's all RNG, but it's, it's okay. It's better than the stupid Goldfish event. Um, no real complaints about it. Like. I personally would never buy the fishes, but uh, it does give you free unbound runes, so it's pretty decent. Uh, what is this? Daily special vouchers, buy items. Uh, so it's one of those discount ones. Um, this event hasn't shown up in a good while. I don't remember it ever having anything amazing in it, uh, but there are, you know, you, you can get that, uh, I think it was a 40% voucher to like reduce the price. Uh, it doesn't hurt, you know, if you see something you want in it, but uh, it's nothing I'm going to go crazy over. I don't think there's going to be anything that can tempt me. Alright, so what is this? The Ninja School Summer Camp. Oh, Winter Camp, Summer Camp. Um, the hell is the Skill Trial Pack? Oh, it's probably the Dusk and uh, um, Vials. Uh, how does this work? Turn event by items. Wait, no, that's the daily special. What is this? <laughs> I have no idea what is this. Uh, oh, actually, this is list all the items that we can buy. Um, I do 
not see anything I want outside of maybe the protection rune pack. I think that's about it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's about it. Uh, moving on, we have Refine Rebate. Yeah, I feel like we're so out of sync. Didn't we just have this like two weeks ago? Or am I going crazy? I don't think I'm going crazy. I think it was definitely two weeks ago. Recruitment feedback, uh, it's pretty good. Um, you know, spend your seal scrolls here, but obviously, ideally, hit all the goal posts. If you don't, don't go for it. Oh, here's the ninja school winter camp. I'm like, looking at them like, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, it's okay. So, this is the event uh, where you collected like, um, what do we call it? Like pencils and stuff, and you traded it in for stuff. Uh, it's a free event. I don't recall what it used to give. Probably Seal Scrolls. Um, yeah, I don't, I really don't remember what it gave. It's been so long. It's been like a year since I've seen this event. Um, but it's a free event, so I can't really complain about it. Uh, it, it it's free stuff. So yeah, it's more or less the week. I don't think we, yeah, that's, that's it. There's nothing else really around. Um, we at least got another skill trial, finally. Uh, it's not a good one, but hey. Beggars can't be choosers, right? I really wish that they would just, you know, release it a little faster. Uh, but, uh, what are you gonna do about it? So yeah, this week looks like a... Eh, week? Like, there are some stuff for everybody, but nothing super special. Um, yeah, so I'll probably come back tomorrow, uh, after we see the prices of everything, and, uh, we'll see if it's raining some frags in the Lucky Wheel, Lucky Star tomorrow. Um, and yeah, um, till tomorrow, guys.